and welcome it's Megan here today I'm doing a healthy grocery haul from Aldi I just want to get back into eating a little better so this is mainly um, meals with lots of veggies and fruits there is a little bit of meat but not too much but yeah I just want to show you guys the stuff that I got and kind of my process of going to Aldi so let's get into it okay and these are just my reusable bags that i keep in my car all the time this one's a cooler bag so it keeps stuff cold but and these are just aldi bags that you can purchase for a few cents there and i think this one's from earth fair another grocery store but yeah now let's look at everything so the first thing i got are just these little potatoes and i figured i could put these in a soup or just eat them by themselves or make mashed potatoes. Next, it's just a bag of oranges because I really like oranges. Next, I got a spaghetti squash. This was a little one, so it's the only one they had, but I'm gonna um, make like a, use it like a pasta and make like spaghetti with marinara sauce, but I already had that in my fridge. Next is just a bag of Granny Smith apples because these are my favorite apples. I love to have them plain and in smoothies and also with peanut butter. Next is just some fresh broccoli. I really love getting fresh broccoli from Aldi because it's affordable. And also I just like fresh broccoli because it tastes really good. And I'm gonna make like a stir fry with it. Next, I just got this organic chopped kale i usually like just plain kale but i didn't see it so i got just the organic one the organic one at aldi isn't as expensive as other places so it's fine i like putting kale in my smoothies and then i'm also putting it in like a stir fry kind of mixed vegetable thing next i bought some spinach same thing i love it in smoothies and in i actually like this in like different pastas mixed in like the stir fry uh, if i eat like eggs or something and like make like a scrambled egg or omelet i like putting stuff in there oh spinach in there salads so spinach is like something i just sprinkle in everything next is just some corn on the cob i love fresh corn i just feel like it tastes really great and i'm actually gonna put this one kind of in the stir fry maybe half of it and then maybe half of it baked or i may put all of it in like the kind of stir fry that my mom made once it's really good i got this cabbage green cabbage it's actually pretty nice size pretty heavy this also goes in like the other stir fry the stir fry that this one goes in it has like a some type of squash which i'll actually show in just a second corn kale and then cabbage and then i eat it with rice okay and here's that yellow squash i was talking about sometimes i'll do zucchini squash but i just wanted to do uh the yellow one just to add some more color and stuff to the dish i also got some green leaf lettuce i can do this for salads and i think i'm gonna be making like some type of wrap or something so i wanted some um i wanted some lettuce okay, i also got some tzatziki dip if it'll focus there it goes and this one's made with greek yogurt so it just has a little bit less calories than one that's made with you know other stuff um i'm actually gonna put this i have some euro meat that i got from the grocery store from i think trader joe's when i went and so i wanted to finally eat that and make like little euros but i wanted some tzatziki dip and i didn't have any more so that's what this is for and then i just got some shredded cheese because i love having shredded cheese like on top of eggs in wraps salads all that good stuff and i got some hummus this is the extremely spicy hummus it's actually i've had the sabra brand one but the aldi brand hummus is fine too i um i like to eat this with like tortilla chips carrots and then also like those little mini peppers the bell peppers and stuff like that so i have some of those already so i was like let me get some more hummus and then i got just some grilled chicken breast strips and i got these just to put on like some salads and just in random stuff that i may want or like if i don't eat it in the salad i think i have some pasta so i can maybe put it in that just as like to throw it in there if i feel like i need it I also got some more peanut butter just because I love having peanut butter in my life with apples, different things. 
I got some banana peppers because I had banana peppers in a salad once and it was really good. I also really like, if I go to like Subway, I get banana peppers on my sandwich. So I figured this might be really good in my Euro, maybe. We'll see how it goes, but I just saw them. So I got some banana peppers. I also got a can of black beans. I like to eat black beans with a lot of different stuff, rice, eggs, just random things. I also got some pepper jack cheese. Sometimes I like to have like cheese and crackers. So I got some pepper jack cheese and then I also got the cheese sticks and these are in cheddar. And I like to get them either sliced or in stick form because it helps me portion control. <laughs> Cause if I use the block, I'll just cut as much cheese as I want. I know it's bad. It's just this roasted garlic Alfredo just because I have some pasta noodles and um, maybe some, I can't remember. I have something that I can put this on. So I was like, let me just go ahead and get it. And then I also got some pineapples. Uh, they're not focusing. There, sort of, maybe. But basically, I just got a can of pineapples. I already have a can, but I like to just keep them. I like putting them in smoothies and just eating them by themselves. So I just like to have them. And then I also got... I also got three boxes of my favorite coffee. I know this is like ridiculous, but this is the coffee that I like. It's like really affordable. It tastes good. I feel like it's strong enough for me and it's affordable. I like it. So I always get a whole bunch of it, <laughs> but yeah, this is the coffee I get. <laughs> and then the last thing that I got was just these brownies. I totally ruined it for being healthy, I know. <laughs> but I just got some brownies because it's like the holidays. I just like having brownies. These are the ones that have double chocolate and then they also have chocolate chips. So it looked really good. Anyway, that was everything that I got at Aldi. I'm back. That was everything I got at Aldi and total I spent $68.47 with tax. So that's cool and Hopefully I'll remember to put the price of each thing up on the screen as I talk about it. So here are some of the meals over the next couple of days that I will be making with these groceries. If you're interested in more, definitely let me know down in the comments below and I can maybe do like another meal video or possible what I eat in a day. So just let me know. So here they are. First we have the spaghetti squash and I just added some marinara sauce. I baked the spaghetti squash in the oven and then I just add the sauce right in there and just scrape the inside. Super easy and it tastes really good as well. I also seasoned the spaghetti squash. And here is the sauteed vegetables. This one has kale, cabbage, the yellow squash and the corn and then I just made some whole grain rice. And this one was one of my favorites and it's super filling. This is my gyro. I made it with gyro meat, banana peppers, feta cheese, that tzatziki dip, and also lettuce. And then I just used a flatbread that I had from a previous grocery haul. Here I just made a salad. It has feta cheese, dressing, pasta, just to make it more filling, and then also that same grilled chicken. And I also threw in some bell peppers, and of course the lettuce from this haul. Here are the rice noodles and the stir fried veggies. The broccoli kind of shredded a little bit because I think I overcooked it so it's not as cute but it still tasted good and then I also added cabbage to it because I had some leftover from the previous meal. And then here is just the pasta with Dalfredo, that grilled chicken, and then I also added some spinach to it. So all of these were super simple, super easy to make and they tasted pretty good as well. That was the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my little grocery haul. I'm trying to, you know, get back into eating a little more healthy and like preparing my meals and, you know, just being conscious of like different things that I'm eating and putting in my body. <laughs> so let me know if you're trying to eat better and, you know, exercise and be healthy and what are some of your like favorite healthy meals and what are some exercises and stuff that you are doing. If you would like to see me talk more about some of this stuff and like the different exercises and things I'm doing, definitely let me know that as well and I can talk more about it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you did, definitely give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in my next one. I love you guys.